Okay, time to talk tires for the under 2 liter Rebel slots. The uh, Escort, as I'm showing you here, the Alpha, and the upcoming BMW. Uh, Quick Slicks has made a new mold for this smaller wheel. It's RS145F. This is the firm compound. And with this wheel, um, we'll show you some photos there. It's different than most wheels in our hobby where, you know, we don't have a raised center rib. We have a reversed groove here. Very, very narrow groove. And, uh, you know, you have to have a little bit of tire to fit in there to keep it from going side to side. I'd still recommend gluing, though. Not really a whole lot to work with there. But Quick Slicks made a really nice mold. They've got the groove molded in place inside the tire there. It's kind of hard to see. I'll take a photo. But it does have the groove fits in there. And it fits the wheel very, very cleanly. Just really nice. I wouldn't expect anything less from these guys they know their stuff so if you're looking for silicone now we have quick slicks as far as your thing goes Paul Gage has released his tires uh, they're a little bit different so you're gonna have to do a little gluing with them they do not have a rib on the inside they are smooth all the way through so you're gonna have to use some glue to make sure that the tire stays on the wheel and that's fine um, we've been gluing tires for many many years I prefer you can use um, Sally Hansen makes a hard as nail strengthener very very strong hard it's a great glue to use um, just give it enough time to dry 30 minutes 40 minutes or so even uh, low cost clear nail polish can do the trick or if you like you can use some testers uh, model glue and you can just use a brush like a cheap uh, artist brush and just coat that on there just a mild coat make sure it gets into the groove around the wheel and then on a flat surface just take it and press it on there just like that make sure the tire is fully seated and that's it that's how I glue them so if you want urethane at least we have that option too. So now we have the stock rubber, we have silicone, and urethane. And uh, I'd say uh, that's a pretty good selection for just about any track condition.